multiple hostile UAV spotted. <laughs> yeah, buddy, diamond camos. Oh my god, I did it. Oh my god. Yes. Come on. Yo, what is up, guys? It is Quasi here, and today I'm bringing you a video. Obviously, it's something that's a personal achievement on Black Ops 3. Like you saw in the video bit before, I did, in fact, get diamond camos for the sniper. Now, I was so happy when I finally did it. Um, I think they look amazing. I will show you what they look like right now. But unfortunately, I wasn't the first person in my clan uh, and all my friends is to do it. One of my good friends and my clan buddy, um, Solo Rai, did it before me. Unfortunately, I have to admit that and I hate to admit it. Um, so anyway, let's get into it and I'll show you what they look like. So obviously the Locust is the first one I did it on. It is in fact my favorite sniper in Black Ops 3. Um, I think they fixed it a little bit with the patching because I think they might have buffed it a little bit because I found that, I don't know about you guys, let me know in the comment section what you think, but I found that it was hit markering quite a lot. Um, and so... Uh, I felt like that that now it's a lot better. It's it's not so much hit markering. Um, the what well, doesn't hit marker as much. Um, so this was actually the first sniper that I did it on. So that looks all very nice. Then we have the SVG. Now this was in fact the last sniper. Um, that I let me take this off so you can see it better. Um, this in fact was the last sniper I did it on, and I did actually use a prestige token to unlock this. I think this is a very good sniper. It pretty much one-shot kills all the time. But I find this hard. If there's a group of enemies, I find it hard to use. Certainly unless you've got rapid fire on it. Because it just doesn't shoot quick enough. But like I said, it's an absolute beast. Um, for, an actual, if, if, for instance, if, you, if you're just one-on-one, -on -one, I mean, this is an absolute beast. This, this, this is going to kill the enemy. Like, no, no, you could shoot him in the toes and you're still one-shot killing him. Um, so, yeah, that's the SVG. Um, then we have the Dracon. Now this Dracon, I think the Diamond Camera probably looks the best on the Dracon and the SVG. Um, it seems to cover the gun a lot more than any other gun. Uh, this one looks really nice. Now I, this probably is my least favorite sniper out of all of them. Um, it took me a little bit longer to get um, Diamond on this. Purely for the fact that it's not a one-shot kill. Um, so, and, and I'm not a big fan of using it. Um... Like I said, I find it. I found it. I found it took me like three, three bullets just to kill him. Whether it was because I was missing one bullet was knowing me. It probably was. Um, but yeah, this is probably my least favorite sniper out of them all. Um, and then unfortunately, because of my level in this prestige, I can't show you the next one. Um, I can show you if I go to the gunsmith. Um, so let's have a look at this one. Here we go. So this is obviously the P. 06 sniper this is the three round burst sniper now i found that if you stick an acog on this or something this this gun is so powerful it's almost like it reminds me a little bit of like the famas from modern warfare 2 it's just it's a three burst so it will kill him in, in one burst and obviously doesn't shoot as quick as the famas and it, there is a slight delay on it as well when you shoot it um it's 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 almost like i don't know if you if you guys played destiny it's almost a little bit like a fusion rifle um, from destiny like if you shoot there's a slight delay before the bullets actually come out but again i found this this was a fun sniper to use it's certainly different and not something that that we've certainly seen before in previous call of duties um so it was good fun to use um what i will do now guys is i will go into the game um to actually show you what they look like while i'm holding it so be right back right so this is the locust um as you can see i think they've done a really good job black ops 3 in a words of diamond camos um, I think they do look better than Black Ops 2 with the fact that you can see like emerald, not emeralds necessarily, but you can see like rubies. You can see like individual diamonds on the gun. And I think that looks amazing. I generally, I think they've done a great job. Also, you can see some diamonds around at the scope. Not so much on the Locus. Um, certainly the other two, other three guns you can see better. Um, in the words of diamonds on the scope as you aim in. So, so that is the Locus. Um, let me just kill myself. Make sure I change gun and let me kill myself. Oh, where's it gone? Oh, I could have just jumped off the edge. I don't know why I did. 
just didn't do that. <laughs> um, so again, this is the SVG. I think this one certainly looks the best in the words of the diamond camo. As you can see on the sniper scope, especially when you zoom, zoom in, look at that around the scope. That just that just looks amazing. Like that's something we obviously we haven't seen before. Certainly in Black Ops 2, in the words of that sort of detail and um, with the diamond camo. Like I said, I think it looks amazing. I think they've done a great job. Um, but guys, let me know in the comment section below um, whether you're trying to go for diamond camo and if you are, which is your favourite sniper to use. Because um, like I said, I found my one is definitely the Locust. So that is the SVG. Um, let's jump off the edge. I'll show you the Dracon. Let's get in the sun to see its glare a little bit better. Um, so again, this is the Dracon. Um, as you can see, guys, it's just the attention to detail with the diamond camos. You can see like on the rubies there at the back of the gun. And when you scope in, um, you can see those diamonds on the edges of the scope. Again, it just it just looks amazing. I'm so I'm so happy that I got it, guys, because it did take me a good two or three days. I know it doesn't sound long, um, but it did take me some uh, dedication, certainly through some bad times to get to get it. Uh, there were a few days that, that I struggled with to, to, to play this game to do it. Um, unfortunately, I can't show you the uh, the PO6 um, gun. Like I said, guys, before it is because uh, I haven't unlocked it yet because I did Prestige. Um, so I haven't quite unlocked it yet. Guys, I will be making another video probably in the near future, in the next sort of week or so, um, about the best way to get diamond camos and sort of some tips and tricks on, on what you can do to help get it um, as quick as possible, really. Um, but like I said, guys, let me know in the comment section below uh, what you think of these diamond camos, whether you think they've done a great job um, and whether you're going to try and get them or not. Uh, like I said, I recommend doing it. I think they look awesome on the snipers. Um, so, yeah, guys, I do hope you enjoyed the video. Um, like I said, I think they've done a great job. Treyarch have done a great job with the diamond camos. Um, they are definitely looking very good on the snipers. Guys, I do recommend you trying to get them. Um, I will be doing a video, guys, on tips and tricks to help you try and get the diamond snipers as quick as possible. So stay tuned for that. Um, also, guys, I would like to shout out um, Solo Rai. He actually is one of my clan members, a good friend of mine. He actually got the diamond camos before me, which I hate to admit. Um, but he is doing a video as well on the diamond camos. So go check him out. I will leave a link in the description of his channel. Um, so go check him out, leave him a sub. He's a great YouTuber. He's going to be bringing out a lot of Black Ops 3 um, content. Um, but like I said, guys, I do hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to subscribe for more. Leave it a like, guys. It really does help the channel. Follow me on Twitch and Twitter. Links will be in the description below. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And as always, this has been Quasi. Have a wonderful day and see you in the next video.